What would happen to the Joker if Batman dies? In the wake of Batman's tragic demise caused by the Joker, the secret behind Gotham City's masked vigilante has finally been unveiled. Revealing himself as the enigmatic billionaire Bruce Wayne, renowned for his business prowess, philanthropy and social standing, Batman's true identity was shared with the world through the journalist Lois Lane. Bruce's loyal butler, Alfred, believed it was time for people to know that Batman and Bruce Wayne were one and the same. He wanted to emphasize that Bruce was an exceptionally selfless individual, never seeking recognition for his heroic acts in the cape. Those who had dismissed Bruce as a mere playboy were now made aware of his true nature and the sacrifices he made to protect the city he loved. During a heartfelt funeral attended by countless individuals, a solemn occasion quickly turned tense when the Joker appeared with a bomb strapped to his body, intending to inflict mass casualties. Amidst the crowd, Mr. Freeze, once Batman's adversary, expressed remorse for not realizing that Bruce Wayne had played a vital role in saving his wife's life through his foundation's support. Wonder Woman, too, spoke highly of Bruce, praising his embodiment of noble qualities. However, the Joker's expectations of encountering grief-stricken individuals were shattered as he found himself surrounded by a surprisingly cheerful gathering. Instead of mourning, the crowd chose to pay tribute to Batman by striving to improve themselves. Suddenly, the Joker experienced a shift in his mood, realizing the futility of being the clown prince of crime if challenges were absent. He pondered over the lack of formidable adversaries, finding little satisfaction in tormenting others when victory came too easily. Even the powerful but seemingly naive Superman failed to pique his interest. The Joker wondered how someone like him, a fiendish and merciless maniac, could find purpose without a worthy rival. As the story concludes, the Joker is depicted working at the Gotham Department of Motor Vehicles, frustratedly enforcing bureaucratic rules and chastising someone for filling out a form incorrectly. In this mundane existence, he yearns for the thrill and excitement that once defined his life.